What's up YouTube, Dave with Mile High Campers coming back at you again with another video. And today we're at the Jellystone RV Park in Estes Park, Colorado for their Halloween weekend. Now before I show you all the cool things we're going to be doing here, let's get into a little bit about the campground itself. Sites 1 through 50 are water and electric sites only. These sites can accommodate tents, truck campers, vans, and RVs up to 25 foot in length. Each site is equipped with a 20 amp electric hookup, water, picnic table, and fire pit. Now sites 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 37 are considered their premium water and electric sites. Now the premium sites include a 50, 30, or 20 amp electric hookup, water, picnic table, charcoal grill, outdoor carpet, and a fire pit. Sites 51 through 111 are back-in full hookup sites. These sites can accommodate RVs up to 40 feet in length. These sites are equipped with a 50, 30, or 20 amp electric, water hookup, sewer, picnic table, and fire pit. Sites 53, 55, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 69, and 105 are premium back-in full hookup sites. Now these premium full hookup sites include a 50, 30, or 20 amp electric, water, sewer, picnic table, charcoal grill, fire pit, and outdoor carpet. Sites 99, 102, 103, 104, 106, and 107 are full hookup pull-through sites. These sites can accommodate an RV up to 40 foot in length, and they are equipped with a 50, 30, or 20 amp electric, water, sewer, picnic table, and fire pit. So here's our setup here at Jellystone. We're in site 71. And as you can see, it just kind of barely fits the camper there. I'm actually gonna have to park my vehicle down the road, but that's okay. The one thing about the Jellystone Campground up here in Estes Park is all the sites are a little bit different. So your setup's gonna be a little different at uh, depending on which sites you're in, but this is what we've got. We've got a nice picnic table there, fire pit, and you will be surprised to know that this is our first full hookup campsite of the summer. So we've got full hookup here, plenty of room for the slides. In this particular site, if you can see it there, the sewer isn't exactly in a great spot, so I'm actually gonna dump when we leave. We're only here for two days, so that's not gonna be a big deal. All the action's gonna be up there at that pavilion, so we're really close. Now, if you don't have an RV, but you still want to enjoy Estes Park and the Jellystone Campground, you can rent cabins. They have a ton of different cabins. They have a wide range of different sized cabins, anywhere fitting from 5 to 14 people. And with amenities all the way from just electric to bathrooms, kitchens, you name it, you need to check it out. Um, I'll have the link in the description below to their website and you can check those cabins out. They are really cool. All right, maybe you don't want to rent a cabin and you want to have the RV experience, but you don't have an RV, no problem. They have an RV that you can actually rent and it's a um, trailer that has a bunkhouse, so that is also an option. Again, check out the links in the description to their website that's got all the information on that. For the first night, I'm gonna make this thing easy and I picked up these pizzas from Papa Murphy's. One thing I love is that the large pizzas at Papa Murphy's will fit in your refrigerator and they'll fit in your oven. They come out perfect. Jellystone is an RV park that is set up for your kids to have a blast. Your kids will stay busy at the pool during the summer months. They also have endless games of miniature golf at the miniature golf course. There's a place to play Gaga Ball. There's a giant jump pad that your kids can jump on. They also have laser tag, and they have a game room with a variety of different arcade games. Oh. 
All right, guys, well, this is the ninth year that we've actually been coming to the Jellystone Halloween weekend, and it's a lot of fun, and I gotta say, if you have an RV, you have a kid, and you're in Colorado, why aren't you here? Now, for the extra activities that they have during the Halloween weekend, you've got the Halloween movie that they play in their outdoor theater on the first night. The main events are on Saturday, which includes a Halloween craft activity at the pavilion. There's a fire truck ride and it takes the kids around the park. There's candy bar bingo. All right, let's hear ya. Oh. golf cart decorating contest, a campsite decorating contest, trick-or-treating throughout the whole park, and a Halloween dance at the pavilion at the end. And if you really want to be scared, they have a haunted hike for the older kids and the adults. All right, let's check out some of these decorated sites. We're gonna take a tour around the campground. Okay guys, I'm gonna show you our campsite now and to stick with the YouTube theme going on right now on the internet, we are doing Area 51, so check this out. All right, so we got our Area 51 sign. We've got our alien over here. We've got our danger tape, of course. And that's where we're gonna be handing out the candy. And um, we might be handing out some other things for the adults, but we'll see. Jello shots, anyone? And then over here, we've got our UFO crash site. Did you make this yourself? So how are you? Got our signs. And my dad built the UFO, so it's handmade. <laughs> and. Um, my brother, he's an electrician, he came in and wired in our LED lights. Not too difficult, but very cool. And then we've got our other alien and UFO conspiracy sign. Ponchi's out playing with us, but he's cold. Huh, Poncho? Are you cold? Ponchi. Triceratops is so cool. All right, C's feeling brave. So we're gonna put on the C cam and he's gonna take you through the haunted hike. Someone's right up here. Oh, <laughs> Someone's gonna be in this chair. Yep, this one's gonna move. Hi. Oh. Hi. Oh. Hi. Oh gosh. Uh, you're joining the hike? Okay. Okay. Um. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my lordy. Hi, hi, hi. I see you. What's up, bro? High five. Thank you. That just happened. Okay. Oh gosh. 
Okay. Yes! Oh. It worked. Okay. <laughs> oh. No, please no. <laughs> wow, it's actually not that bad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, I, I saw peed. the chainsaw. I just peeled. <laughs> Sean, I, told, I said chainsaw, chainsaw, chainsaw. There's <laughs> oh dear lordy, what's up, dude? Darn it. Well, oh my gosh, I just peed a little. Go first. We're not done. I'm gonna let you go first. No, you can go first. Oh my god. I don't want to go first. Go. Excuse me, I already peed my pants, so please be nice. I don't like this. Please wait. All right guys, well like I said, if you've got kids, you've got an RV and you're in Colorado, there's no reason why you shouldn't be checking this place out, especially for their themed weekends. It's totally fun. Be sure to check out the description for all the links to our store, as well as to the Jellystone RV park. And as always guys, thank you so much for watching. We really hope you enjoyed this video and we'll catch you on the next one. Peace.